guys, welcome back to another video of More at Homestead. Before we begin, make sure you like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell. We're going to show you a little bit of how come the jets ain't on? Because they, they haven't been on. They haven't been on. Had them on. It's 99 <laughs> degrees. 99? I want to. Ah! Oh! Oh! Yeah. Oh, like jets on, folks. I didn't see the button. You didn't see the button? What do you think, Bob? I love it. the kids are having a great time i wanted to thank uh dutch over there keeping it dutch for hooking me up with this hot tub i didn't talk, tell y'all in the first video but one of you guys knew it you guys uh said you can just tell dutch thanks for the uh hot tub or something like that so it's funny but anyways dutch uh hit me up see if i wanted this said yeah got it going finally uh so that's a plus kids love it it's uh, about 45 degrees out here today and they're in 100 degree water so they're having so much fun so here in a little bit hunter and i here in a little bit hunter and i are going to uh open up a mystery tackle box box um that we got at walmart today it's uh, about 17 dollars, but it's got around 25 30 dollars worth of baits in it they had about 11 boxes there and i lined them all up and i let him pick whichever box he wanted and uh, we're gonna see what's in it here in a little bit but right now they're having too much fun in the hot tub so we're gonna have to wait on that but once again i'll like say thanks dutch for hooking us up with that hot tub uh appreciate our friendship and all that you do for us here at morehead homestead and uh the kids definitely appreciate it so thanks okay well we got here this mystery tackle box i'll show you up closer you can actually get a subscription to these and they'll send them every month and it's actually cheaper if you do it that way um, but they got five to six baits in it, and he chose box number 68. You ready? All right, you ready, bud? Yep. 
Toe boxes. Toe boxes? Mystery tackle box. Right there, pull that out. Pull that out right there. Ooh. Check out everything in here. Now, I'm just going to take it all out. All right, let's see what you got. That's just a sticker, I think, there. Or is that a tattoo? That's a sticker. Ooh, a spinnerbait. Look at that. Got some hooks. A little crankbait. Show me that little crankbait. What are those? Instructions. Instructions. What do we do with instructions? Show them what we do with instructions. I know ribbon. Is that what we do with instructions? You can't even do it. I can. Oh. We don't need those, do we? Get rid of those. What else we got in there? What else we got in there? Ooh, little crawls. Those are pretty cool. And some swim baits. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I like this part, it has a roller. Yeah, we can measure your fish. You want to show everybody what else you got today? So Hunter does a lot of fishing with me, but he's got those little Spider-Man poles and all that, and I really can't support a good sized fish. So this is one of my older Falcon original rods. Um, it's a really good rod, and we got him this little uh, bigger Zepco reel on it, and uh, some eight pound test line we put on it, and it should do the trick. He wanted to put this chatterbait on there, so this springtime, we'll run that chatterbait up there on the lake along the grass lines. And what's going to happen? Get some. What are we going to get? Some bass. Some big old bass, delicious huh? Delicious bass. You going to catch mama delicious bass? <laughs> I guess so, I've never seen Napoleon down much. Yeah. So what do you think of all this stuff? I like that little spinnerbait. That's what you threw before on the lake. I like this. And it's a little crankbait. I like these. Those crawls? Yeah, they're really cover, colorful. So it's kind of cool. Um, I've thought about signing him up for the survival one, the outdoor one. They got them for different age Can groups, and they send you outdoor stuff. Um, I've Where? always thought about doing this for myself, but I never have. And I saw them at Walmart, and I thought it'd be cool just to see what's in it and if it's really worth doing it every month. Um, I would say if you fish a lot, yeah. Um, like these swim baits are probably six bucks each. Um, crank baits are normally four to five bucks each. Spinner baits are three to six bucks, depending on what kind. And uh, these crawls are probably around five bucks. They don't gotta. But so if you add it all up, we spent seventeen bucks on it, and yeah, twenty-five dollars. Oh, these are hooks. Yeah, four out hooks. There's three of them here. So we use these for Texas rigging worms and stuff, and. And uh, crawls or lizards or stuff like that. So I would say, yeah, it's definitely worth it if you're into fishing. You can sign up. I it, think, it, yeah, mysterytacklebox.com. And I think it's actually called Carl's Mystery Tacklebox.com now or something like that. But they send you, um, I think it goes off like the month and what region you're in. They'll send you baits that are relevant to that time period. Like if, uh, you're in Oklahoma and it's the springtime, they'll be sending you spring baits, probably top waters and stuff like that. And if it's winter time, they'll probably send you some uh, deep diving crankbaits or some uh, long worms or just stuff that you fish in the wintertime, jigs. So uh, that's the, the plus side of doing it online. You get baits that are relevant to the time period each month that you'll be able to throw each month. Where, so Where's this on there? Spinner bait, right there. Eight. Daddy. Check it, I got a fish on you. Ah, get off! No. Don't 
Like this, so now I can All right, guys. Well, that's all we got on today's video. If you like this video, smash that like button. If you have subscribed to our channel yet more not, at Moran Homestead, make sure you subscribe and... Ring that notification bell. Ring that notification bell. All right, guys. That's all we got. Until next time. Thanks for watching. Whoa. <laughs> and God bless.